change is a natural part of our life and that we cannot control this change. But don't let this change control you. I, Sanj Khoge, extend my warm greetings to the respected dignitaries and all the students present over here. 21st century is the age of information, the era of technology. And this 21st century has brought AI and social media to its greatest height. Earlier, AI and social media were merely a want, but today they have become a need, a need of Gen Zs. But have you all ever wondered that where are we heading to? Or what are we feeding our brain with? If not, then let's do it now. Take a pause and ask yourselves that while solving a problem or while completing a project, do you ask your intellect first? Or is it easier to ask AI in just one single click? When you, while scrolling over various social media sites, when you make up a mind of one last scroll, but does that one last scroll leads to a hundred more? If yes, then congratulations, my dear friends. We have dug a pitfall for ourselves. Now, talking from a scientific point of view, our brain is a network of neurons. And when we are making overuse of AI and social media, it simply damages this network of neurons, thereby deploying our intellect and thinking capabilities. It also releases a hormone into our brain called dopamine, also regarded as the feel-good hormone, which in turn makes one addicted to social media and also adverse, adversely affects our physical well-being. But by practicing mindfulness meditation on a regular basis, we can create a fine balance, a fine balance between the usage of AI and social media and our mental well-being, thereby making it a win-win situation for all of us. Now, here's a small question I would like to ask all of you out there. Kindly think and reflect. So, my dear friends, what do you think? Who is the creator? Humans or AI? Of course, we humans are the creators of AI. So, my dear friends, don't let your creativity fade away. Excessive use of AI and social media proves to be a sin. But if used in limit, then it definitely proves to be a blessing in disguise. So, my dear friends, the choice is yours whether to make AI and social media a sin or a blessing. Thank you.